How's it going everyone, Lunar here, and in today's video, I'm gonna go over the best ways to increase your FPS in CSGO. So I hope this video helps you all out and you all enjoy it. The first thing we are going to go over is launch commands to help with FPS. The first one being dash high it'll be on your screen this launch command forces the game to be the highest priority for your cpu if you're having low fps you can try this console command out and see if it improves your fps the next one is no d3 d9 ex1 of course that'll be on your screen again and this disables an extension used in windows called direct 3d 9 ex and can definitely help with fps if you're playing in full screen specifically now, when it comes to launch commands, if neither of these help with your FPS, then I don't suggest leaving them there because the more launch commands you have, the more it can actually impact your game and even lower your FPS. Now, the next thing we are going to hop into is your in-game settings, which is very obvious. If you're having low FPS issues, then I highly suggest turning all of your in-game settings to low or maybe even playing at a lower resolution like something like 4.3 to help your game render everything faster and not have as much going on. Now, the next thing is console commands. There are three specific console commands that can help you out. The first one being FPS underscore max 99. I'm sure all of you know this. This limits the cap on your frame rate and can help you reach higher FPS. A lot of the time your game might be defaulted to FPS underscore max, you know, 300. And then changing it to 999, you'll definitely reach higher FPS. So the next console command is R underscore dynamic zero. This takes away all the excess lighting, like things such as lens flares, lens flares and stuff like that. And this console command has helped people tremendously. And when I had lower FPS issues before actually upgrading my PC, it definitely helped a ton and made my higher FPS. Now the final console command is mat underscore Q underscore mode two or negative one. This once again sets CSGO as a priority in your computer and allows your PC to use the threads available that you do have and you really do have to mess around with it to see if two or negative one works the best for you. When I used to use it, two worked perfectly fine and it completely fixed my FPS issues. But I hope you all enjoyed this video and I hope something in this video helped you increase your FPS even more in CSGO. Now, if none of these things didn't work for you, there are a ton more options out there that, and I just really picked the best ones and the ones that previously worked for me, but it, they also worked for other people as well. But ultimately, it is possible you might just have to upgrade things in your PC such as your GPU or your CPU and motherboard but I hope you all enjoyed this video I hope it helped you out and I hope I helped you guys gain some FPS in a free way but my name is Lunar and I'll catch you all with another video tomorrow